Yeah. Now you guys grew up here in in, uh, in Odd, West Virginia. How how many years have you lived here? <laughs> All her life. All my life. I'm embarrassed that it's taken me 25 years to realize this. It is not enough to be not racist. You have to be anti-racist. If you're white, if you look like me, use your privilege. And for those who do not think white privilege exists, you are delusional and you are part of the problem. You guys, I mean, did you go to school? You did? So, some, some, of your some of your brothers and sisters probably didn't go to school or how much schooling did they get? They didn't, they didn't wish school long. He graduated. You graduated from what? We were working high school. You went to high school, Timmy? Yeah, he went to high school all in bed. And how about you, Lorraine? No, she didn't went to school. She didn't. If you're white, if you look like me, use your privilege. And for those who do not think white privilege exists, you are delusional and you are part of the problem. <laughs> so you, you grew up here in, in odd West Virginia your whole, your whole life. And your, your family, you, you lost your brother since I was here last. <laughs> Come on, Ray, get on the board. If you look like me, use your privilege. And for those who do not think white privilege exists, you are delusional and you are part of the problem. <laughs> oh, is, is that Freddy's grave? Is that Freddy's grave? You are delusional and you are part of the problem.